So, Zendaya, is the trophy the ultimate prize for you, or is it something else about this competition? Um, honestly, it's something else. I feel like the trophy is nice to say that you have, but my main goal is to inspire the little kids that are watching me. You know what I'm saying? I want to be a positive role model for them, and I want them to see someone their age working hard and, you know, showing that age doesn't really define what you can do and what dreams you can, you know, go for. And I don't want them to think that there's an age limit on that. So that's the most important thing. If I, you know, have inspired some kids to maybe start ballroom dancing or, you know, go out for their soccer team or whatever, then that's, that's what I'm really here for. So in your very analytical mind, because you win that prize here, uh, how do you know you're going to impress the audience on Monday night? Uh, <laughs> I mean, I don't know. I, don't know. I, I just hope the audience will respond to, to our performance. But, I mean, it's hard to answer that question right now. We're still working. We're still trying to get our routines right. Um, I don't know, man. I think at the end of the day, one thing I always count out, which, you know, I'm always stressing and I'm always anxious and I always want the best. And I, and I constantly forget that one key factor that, that is probably our biggest, the biggest advantage that we have, which is us. <laughs> I just feel like when she dances, she dances with passion and emotion. When I dance, I, I dan I'm, I'm in a different world, you know? And I think that's what the audience really appreciates about us. Not, not how technically savvy we are or how impressive she is as a dancer, but more about how she feels when she's performing. And, and the same for me. So I think that's how we're going to win the audience over, just by connecting with them, with them, you know, getting a warm feeling. I want them to get chills when they watch us dance. That, that's, that's my biggest thing. If you get chills, then, then we already won, then I know it's a successful number. People say, if you dream it, you can be it. And so you're dreaming of tens, but you're wearing every other number <laughs> on your pants except a ten. Is that well, a good you thing? Well, put them together, they make tens and, and higher numbers. So, you know, that's what I'm going for. <laughs> sure, okay. Okay, so um, our freestyle is different because... Because I think it's, like he was saying, it's not necessarily so much about... You know, it's a supersized freestyle, so you can use anything. You can literally do anything, but I don't want to just rely on everything to make it a good number. I want to rely on the dancing. I want to rely on the emotion and the passion, and that's what I want people to notice, not, you know, big, crazy lights going on behind me or explosions or whatever. I want it to be about what I've learned in my journey here, so that's that's the most important thing. I think, you know, I think you need to strategize. You know, and I think uh, other pros are very smart about how they showcase their celebrities, you know. Uh, in, in my case, the more I could showcase her, the, the, the better it is for me. The less fluff I could have, you know, so the attention doesn't leave her, the better it is, you know. In other instances, maybe it's opposite. Maybe you want things to kind of take your attention away from some sort of flow or some sort of imperfection. Here, I personally, I want all eyes on her throughout the entire thing so that could people really appreciate how she dances, how she feels, how she, how she performs. Last quick question. In the world of never let him see you sweat, um, who feels more pressure right now, Zendaya or Val? <laughs> I think we're both feeling the same amount of pressure. We just show it in different ways. I think I, yeah, he I'm shows it. You, you show it. I, I'm kind of a G and kind of just keep it aside. But, uh, yeah, I, I'm, I'm, you know, I wear my emotion on my sleeve. So, um, yeah, I'm stressing, but but I want her to still have fun. You know, you know <laughs> what I mean? Like, this is a week that I actually feel like she's also a little bit stressed out. And, uh, and I, I don't want her to, you know. And I know that she's stressed out because she really wants to win for me because of what we talked about, you know, me not being, being the only one that number one in the final. Uh, I, I really, you know, she said it to me kind of, but not really. And, and I know that she feels that way. You know, she really wants to win it for me. And I don't want her to feel that way. I want her to relax, enjoy it. I'll be happy regardless. I won already a long time ago. You know, Dancing with the Stars title would mean a lot to me because this is something that I've invested, you know, two years of my life. This, this is not an overnight thing. But I have plenty of titles that I, I'm very proud of that, has not, that have nothing to do with Dancing with the Stars. And so you good. If a wing right, in your boat would be nice, right? It would so be we'll very work on nice. that. We'll work on that. Make that happen. Go dance. Thank <laughs> you.